Rangit, the name of a river in the Himalayan Sikkimis district, and Rahil, which in Arabic means traveler or someone who shows the way. Just wrapped up an eight-hour shoot, out since nine in the morning, face full of makeup. I got to put in the hours. Off to the gym now to train the clients. Bought day outfit, every day outfit. I was just ten years old when my mother passed away, and never really got the chance to ask her what she thought before giving me this rather unique name. But over a decade later, when I tried to step into her thinking boots, I can only imagine that being the fierce woman that she was in all walks of life. This name was her ode to me to keep on being relentless and never let any boulders stand as hindrances in my greatest quest to reach my final destination. Just like the ebbs and flows of the waves. This name was an ode to be free like the river and be unhinged like the traveler set to see the world and draw from it the same sheer perseverance which never lets either stop. This was a nod to pave and show the way and create a greater impact for the community as a whole. Today I turn 23 <laughs> and view it as an opportunity to touch the lives of 23 more individuals and give the world 23 more reasons to remember this name by through my deeds when the mortal existence ceases to be. The only tradition throughout the eight years, the birthday workout which cannot be missed. I do not celebrate birthdays, go out and party by choice. From the age of 16 all the way till today, I have made it a point to celebrate my birthdays within the four walls of the gym, with what has given me everything that I have and everything that I am today, the iron. These birthday workouts serve as special reminders and an ode to my bird giver, watching from up there, that the greater goal is to keep carrying on the relentless hustle until the celebration of your existence is not bound to a single day, but becomes perpetual. Ending of a long day, yet another year, at the gym itself, no other place I'd rather celebrate it. The greater goal is to follow the path of the Greek god of perpetual time and eternity, and soon enough get to say,